Hey guys, what's up? I am Jeremy from Well Tech Designs and I have something awesome to show you and it is another Ford Econoline van and we're going to do this in 360 fashion. So new camera we're going to have some fun with, play around with and um, see how you guys like this video. So that way if you don't want to be looking at this mug as you can also watch this video at the same time you will be able to also take a look at this awesome van behind me. This thing is ginormous um, and you can see here this is going to be a six inch kit. This is our Baja grocery getter kit up front um, and as we go ahead we'll peek our heads down in here and just kind of show you guys this. The extended radius arms and then around up here in the front we're gonna kind of twist, twist that. You can see we've also done our Fox steering stabilizer. So this is Jeff's van and Jeff is from I would say that it's beautiful Seattle, but I've never been there to actually talk about that firsthand. Maybe it's time for a road trip up there, but you can see he's added a ton of lights on this thing. And if you guys want to see more on this, I'm gonna kind of skip around here a little bit. And right here, living on the globe, check him out on Instagram. I know that they just got back from a killer trip um, down into South America, which I'm, super jealous like awesome um in the back of this we've done the same thing we're running our baja grocery getter kit on here but i really want to kind of take a look back at this and you know what we might even be able to get this up there kind of high let's see if we can see it we're gonna grow instantly there it is pretty cool so that he's got some solar going up on there and you know like i always tell like i always say in these videos i love showing you guys what other people are doing in here um, or doing to their vans and what he's doing in here has been super cool and what we are going to do is i'm not going to exclude that but we're going to take a walk around the back of this thing um, in order to check it out and now this thing sits amazing i love the way that this thing sits just a little bit high you're in the back and that's going to be great because if he adds more gear to it no problem this is the eight leaf pack spring that we did here on the rear of this um, and it's still sitting on some smaller tires so this is going to look a lot better when he goes to a big tire this is currently a 245 75 16 on here um, so you can see i know a lot of people ask well if i lift my van and still have smaller tires on there is it going to look funny well this is a good way here's a good check it out what do you guys think um comment below you know i know these tires are smaller but i don't think it looks ridiculous let me know your guys' opinion comment below um and while you know you're commenting below dude that thumbs up you know um so as we come over here and check this thing out this is awesome hey i'm back one more thing i forgot to show you guys was this awesome box that is here on the back of this thing. And this is just going into the trailer hitch, but I'm not sure at the cost of one of these, but definitely super cool as far as the ability to give you guys a lot of storage. So that's it, just wanted to make sure I showed you guys that. I don't wanna miss that. But uh, once again, make sure you guys go check, check these guys out at Living, um, on the globe sorry at living on the globe i wanted to screw me all up but there it is and then i guess the only th other thing i missed is look check this out um arb awning on the side of this which is nice um, i know i use my awning a ton and really like it i'm gonna be dumping insulation out of the back of this thing i'm gonna have to grab a yoga mat maybe we'll go do some yoga here at the same time um so you can see he's added a rear camera on the back of this definitely very useful and some additional lighting um, and what's really cool is Jeff did this whole build out himself so like I said I love showing you guys what other people are doing is that I'm gonna go ahead and hop up in here and like I said if you don't want to stare at me go ahead flip this thing around and get the 360 view of what's going on in here but you can see he's done wood floor or wood in the ceiling um, and I like this I don't know if I've ever really seen this before I like how you have this back kind of like loungy as well as kitchen area. I'm gonna have my sink in here, which is cool. And we're gonna try this. Let's see here. All right, maybe we're just gonna keep holding it. Um, we'll get some other shots of this. But you can see what I dig about this is like, 
this fibering top that is on here extends over the windshield of the van which is huge because now i mean not only storage but i mean this is like a seven foot bed it looks like i mean this is a ton of space up there for sleeping and what's cool about this is as we come down here you'll see that these other slats are completely removable so that if you didn't want it all the way out um, in order to have that additional bedding or storage you could have that out and i'm pretty sure even with it out though i'm gonna pop that up right here i mean i still i mean it's like the normal roof of a van so i still have a ton of clearance this is like my van right now so that's really really cool um as far as being on the inside of this um, being able to move these now i could stand up walk around all the way to the front of it um, it does look as if the front seat uh, at least on the passenger seat is also on a swivel base so that is also something that is really cool i like that um, and then there's just a ton of little I kind of dig this like magnetic hook so check this thing out magnetic hook so I could just post this up wherever I want and now I have an instant little hook to be able to hang stuff and they have a bunch of them all throughout here so I'm sure they're using those for gear or whatever else it may be but um and then in here as well move some stuff out of the way um you'll see that they've also done some really cool hardwood you know wood looking laminate floors in there um which you know that i love because i have them in mind uh it doesn't look oh so then we have our other door more you know cabinets and we got our seats our gas can here just hanging out but um i want to go jump back to the back of this thing and really check that out more because i think that's the best part about this is that you know living hey guys what's up jeremy back at you here and we're in the shop and there's austin so if you don't know what austin looks like there it is there's austin that's the guy in the youtube making it all happen and i don't know what i'm doing so this video is going at the end of this awesome walkthrough that we just did and because i am new to this awesome gopro 360 camera um i'm not quite sure how to use it i'm figuring it out but what I really want to know is, is do you guys like this kind of walkthrough or is it better when Austin's filming it? You know, he's getting the shot, doing what, all the rad stuff. So let me know what you guys think as far as that goes. I would love to hear it. Yay, nay, thumbs up, thumbs down. Um, and leave your comments below. So that's it. Otherwise, I will see you guys on the next video. Here, you can see, here, enjoy some gas pumps. All right, all right, later.